Amid, I have them. I have the box and the Koinor. Arbas, Sliman and his troops have taken the palace. What? Piara. Sliman has her. It is a trap! They know you will come! Perhaps, but they will not see me coming. Hold on, Piara. I'm coming. There she is. I know you're there, assassin. 
One false move on your part, and I'm afraid your beloved princess will suffer the consequences. If Sleeman sees me, I'm dead. You've brought this on yourself, assassin. You've meddled with things that don't concern you or your kind. We should have ended this long ago, but we let your puny little order slip through our grasp. Well, I am to make up for that mistake, starting with you. You should already be dead, assassin. I thought that rabid dog Burns would be the end of you. You've only really got one choice, you know. Give me the box and the diamond, and I will kill only you. I'm growing weary of your little vanishing act, assassin. Why don't you step out of the shadows and face me like a man? There! Be a good boy and just die! Let her go, Sleeman. We can resolve this without her. Give me the box and the jewel, and I'll let her live. Let her go first. No. The box and the jewel. Toss them now. I'm sorry, Abbas. Kiara. I'm sorry too. You'll both be very sorry if you don't toss me that box and the jewel now! Damn! Are you okay? Did he hurt you? Did you not see? I hurt him. I may recruit you into the Brotherhood. Shut up. Now go after him and get that box back. I'm not leaving you. The place is filled with Templars, Piara. The Brotherhood will get this box back. Oh, he knew. He grabbed it. You have my thanks, Arbaz. Cannot have been easy to retrieve the diamond. Take good care of it, Ethan. It is truly unique. It would be a shame if its fate was to remain hidden in a safe. I will. You have my word. The diamond's journey is just beginning. <laughs>